for us to find the intercepts of the equation y equals negative 2x and then graph. And there's a couple ways of doing this because the equation is in sloped intercept form. But let's first find the intercepts like we have been doing in order to find the horizontal intercept or x intercept, we set y equal to zero and solve for x. If we substitute zero for y, we have zero equals negative two x. To solve for x, we divide both sides by negative two. Simplifying, negative two divided by itself simplifies the one, one times x is x. We have x equals zero divided by negative two, which is zero, and therefore the horizontal intercept is the ordered pair zero comma zero. Again, it is important to give the intercepts as ordered pairs. We set y equal to, we set y equal to zero, and then when we solve for x, we also got zero. So if we plot this point on the coordinate plane, notice how this is the origin, and the origin is the only point on the horizontal axis, as well as the vertical axis, and therefore in this case, the origin is both the horizontal intercept, as well as the vertical intercept. Another way we could have found the intercepts is to recognize, again, the equation is in sloped intercept form. We can write the equation as y equals negative two x plus zero. And because the equation is in sloped intercept form where b is equal to zero and b is the y intercept or vertical intercept, the vertical intercept is the origin, which would also be the horizontal intercept. Either way, we need at least one more point to graph the line and we can do this by making a table of values or recognizing again the equation is in slope intercept form and therefore the slope is negative two. Let's first make a table of values. Let's let x equal one and x equal two. When x is equal to one, y is equal to negative two times one which is negative two. And when x is equal to two, y is equal to negative two times two, which is negative four. Let's go ahead and plot these two points. To plot one comma negative two from the origin, we move right one and down two. And to plot two comma negative four from the origin, we move right two and down four. Or again, we could have found these points, again by recognizing, because the equation is in sloped intercept form, m, the coefficient of x, is negative two which is a fraction is negative two over one, and the slope is equal to the vertical change over the horizontal change, or the change of y divided by the change of x. So if we go back to the vertical intercept or the horizontal intercept, notice how if we go down two and right one, down two and right one, we could have also found these two points using the slope. Either way, we can now make a nice graph of the line. I hope you found this helpful.